So someone wanted to know about post-viral optic neuropathy, and in particular, post-viral papillitis. So again, the problem is with this word itis, which you don't normally means inflammation or infection, but because papilledema was taken for increased ICP, we, we can't use that word. So post-viral papillitis could be from multiple mechanisms. And so the presence of the disc edema in the setting of a viral illness actually doesn't differentiate the mechanism. So we've gotta be thinking mechanistically, what are the possible causes of this person's disc to be swollen? And of course, the obvious one is you have an infection. So either a direct infectious or a post-infectious response to the virus. And that's super common. The thing that we're gonna be looking for on the MRI scan for that kind of presentation is optic nerve enhancement. So if we see the nerve is enhancing, the disc is swollen, papillitis, they had a virus, that's gonna be optic neuritis as the mechanism, but in this case, a post-viral optic neuritis, because you can't differentiate post-viral optic neuritis from other forms of optic neuritis, MS, demyelinating disease, NMO, MOG, you have to work it out. Because even if they had the virus, that doesn't mean the virus caused it. Number two, you've got meningeal inflammation. So if you had viral meningitis, that can cause the papillitis and increased intracranial pressure related to outflow obstruction can cause papilledema that looks like post-viral papillitis. And you could have localized vasculitis that could make an ischemic event called non-arteritic anterior ischemic optic neuropathy, but not your garden variety NAON, a localized optic nerve head ischemia from a localized vasculitis related to the post-viral disease. And so you basically have to do an MRI and a lumbar puncture and work this up just like any papillitis. And if you had no white matter lesions, no meningitis, nothing was found, post-viral is what we call that, but really what you said was idiopathic, but it sounds better to say post-viral.